Hello friends, welcome to SQL Server video tutorial. Today we will see an interview question that is how to insert a new column between the existing columns in a table. As long as we are following the coding standard, uh, the order of the columns doesn't matter. But still, if somebody wants to know how we can insert a new column between the existing columns in a table, here I'll show you two methods through which you can insert a new column. First, go to SQL Server Management Studio. Here, uh, uh, in this video, I'll show you with an example uh, uh, to insert a new column in a student table. First, I'm connecting to the database which I want, that is example database. Then select start from student table, select top 10 start from student table. As you can see here, here I have four columns, ID, first name, last name and city. So in this example, I want to insert a new column between the last name and city. That is, I want to insert a father name column between last name and city columns. So how I'll show you how we can do this. First, go to this, uh, this side, expand the databases as I'm showing here. In student table, as you can see, we have four columns. Then right click on the student table, then click on design. So this video, this screen will appear. So click on uh, right click on city column and press on uh, insert a new new column so here you can enter father name and select whatever the data type you want once it is done you can save it as i'm showing it here after you save this we'll refresh the tables and we'll see where this column is added so as you can see here this father name column is added between last name and city Generally, whenever we add a new column using alter statement, that will be added at the end. So, in this scenario, if we use alter table command, it will be added after the city. So, here we will delete uh, this column, the new column which we added and we will see another method through which we can add a new column between the existing columns in a table. See, I have deleted that column. Now, I am using the alter table script, alter table, table name add for the name I'm giving the data type here so once we execute this command this further name column will be added at the end that is this column will be added after the city column so I executed this let's refresh this and see so as you can see a further name column is after the city uh, have you ever wondered that where uh, how these columns are uh, ordered in a table and where this information is stored this information is stored in information underscore cma dot columns view this is a view system view in this view we have complete information about all the tables tables and the position order of the each column in a table so i'll show you for sample data in this table select top 10 star from information schema dot columns this is a view so when you execute this as you can see here it have all the tables table schema column names and the order or the position of the columns in the table here in this case we need uh, um, we need information about the student table students table so here we'll use where condition where table name is students so we'll run this command as you can see here uh, id is in the position one uh, first name is in position two last name is in position three and the city is in position four and father name is in position five what we want now is we want to bring this father name to the fourth position and then city to the fifth position what we can do is we'll update this view so we'll write the command here update information schema view set ordinal position that is this is the position which decides the uh, order of the columns ordinal position equal to 4 in table that is where table name is equal to students and column name equal to father name and 
and column name is equal to further name so similarly uh, we have to need, we need one more update statement for the city column that is we need to make the ordinal position of the city column as 5 so we we'll write one more update command here update information dot schema column set ordinal position is equal to 5 where table name is equal to students and uh, column name is city so we'll run these two update commands now Uh, executing command executed successfully let's check the ordinal position of these columns in the information schema so as you can see here see here father name is moved, moved to fourth position and city is moved to fifth position this is how you can insert a new column between the existing columns thanks for watching videos thank you